Yo, what's going on you guys? It's Dr. J and we're back with some more NBA 2K18 my team and my heart is pounding because I just bought this pink diamond 99 overall James Harden and I actually overpaid a little bit on it I think or I, I overbid a tiny bit but not like that much because like some have been going for like 300,000 and this one was like at 212 or something and I accidentally got to like 240 wait it says 247 but like 233 next to it so I think it's gonna get me back some but I just went from having like 260,000 MT to like 12,000 so I don't know if that's really worth it or not but just like recently he was going for like a million so maybe his price will go up eventually you know this may be a good thing but dude look at this it's gonna be back 13,000 too so that's really nice uh, I don't know if I should keep him or not, but I'm just gonna see how good he is. But dude, my first pink diamond in NBA 2K18. I'm so excited. So let's go to the Rockets, go to James Harden, and look at that. Dude, 99 overall, James Harden. 99 offense, 99 defense, of course. He has 12 Hall of Fame badges. Dimer, pick and roll maestro, ankle breaker, relentless finisher, Tear dropper, acrobat, catch and shoot, tireless score, difficult shots, limitless range, deep uh, deep range dead eye, and mid range dead eye. And uh, here's some of the gold badges as well. Dude, that is insane. He's got like, wow, he's got 10 of these like personality traits, I think. 10 or so. A plus, A plus, A plus, A plus, A plus. Dude, everything is an A+, plus except for post-defense, which, which is a C+. Plus. This card is, like, perfect, almost. 99 standing and driving layup, 96 post fadeaway, 99 draw foul, 99 shot close, 98 open shot mid-range, as well as contested and off dribble, as well as open shot 3 contested and off dribble, dude, that's insane. 99 free throw, 98 ball control, 99 passing vision, 99 passing IQ, Passing accuracy 93, box down 95. His dude's rebounding is sick. 92 offense and 94 defense. Lateral quickness 95, 98 pass perception, 96 shot contest, 96 steal, uh, 98 steal. Uh, defensive consistency is an 85. I thought it would be high because of those numbers, but whatever. Uh, driving dunk 98, contact dunk is a 95. Speed 98 and speed whip balls at 95. Acceleration 98. Vertical 97, Stamina 99, 97 Hustle, 98 Shot IQ, 99 Hands, 98 Reaction Time, and Offensive Consistency is a 99. Dude, this card's insane. Um, and everything here looks great, except for Triangle, which is an 82, but I use Balance, so it's fine for me, you know? But, uh, dude... This card looks insane, so I'm gonna go check him out in freestyle, and I'll see you guys there in just a second. Okay, we're in freestyle right now with the James Harden Pink Diamond. And just to recap, inside is an A+, plus, three points an A+, plus, and mid-range is A+, plus, and playmaking is an A+, plus, and everything, holy crap, is a hot spot. There's one. Oh, he just ran away. <laughs> Dude. The game is released a little bit late by accident. Oh, come on. No. His shots. I'm not used to his shot, really. There we go. I bet I can get used to it, though, pretty easily. Yep. That's the exact same animation he just did. <laughs> Dude, this is special right here. Come on. Aw, oh, man. Dude, this is gonna be so fun to use. Can't wait to do this uh, in Supermax and stuff. Dude, this card is so good. I've been saving my MT lately because I was really wanting to buy uh, like that Diamond Kobe. Or maybe even get like that Diamond LeBron. Um, so, you know, in a way, I could have actually gotten like Diamond LeBron and then Diamond Cousins, you know? 
uh, because it could help like fill like the void in like some positions, you know, like getting a bigger guy. Like getting LeBron could help me get, um, you know, I could put him at power four so that way I had a diamond lineup. But you know, like it's it's kind of hard to pass up a, a pink diamond, you know, for this cheap. And uh, I don't know if you guys know about the glitch that was going on, but like, um, you know, like for the Chinese New Year's event, they uh, dropped a ton of like uh, new content, like Yao Ming and like Michael Beasley, Stephon Marbury, and, Jay and Jeremy Lin. But in the process, they there was a glitch that happened where they put out a ton of James Harden. So people were pull pulling him in like every single pack, you know? So like, I watched some videos uh, like Shake and Bake and Kills and Moy, uh, they pulled like a, almost like a total of like 30 pink diamonds uh, for like both videos. And uh, you know, like people were just like constantly like opening packs and getting them. It was super glitch. And then like people were actually able to like uh, put them up for a buy it now. Some even did like as low as like 20 to 30,000. Unfortunately, I was like. Uh, I don't know what time it happened. I must have been like sleeping or whatever or else I would have been on it, you know But like I really wish I could have been a part of that uh, But by the time I I found out about it and I tried opening a few packs It was like not it was like gone, you know So I wish I could have gone in for cheaper there, but like I'm so happy to get this pink diamond and Yeah, like like I said, I don't know if I'll keep it or not because there are some cards that will come out to us later on in the year that I'd like to get like I would love to get like a Vince Carter or like I said before I really want to get that Kobe card because Kobe is my favorite player and Vince is one of my favorite players too and I already have Allen Iverson so but man I figured this card could really help out a lot you know he's just got such a good like shot you know oh and that banked in can you shoot from like pass it right here oh I bet that can go in but yeah, I'm really excited to have this. And I'm trying to remember, I think my one of my first pink diamonds last year, or the first one I got, I it was probably I don't know if it was the from the weekly challenges or not. I feel like it was from um, like the March Madness thing. I believe my first diamond was probably like Dwayne Wade or something. Oh, he just did a jiggle move. That was weird. <laughs> but yeah, like uh, they dropped like a locker code last year for. Pink Diamond Dwayne Wade and I actually ended up getting him um, and that was that was awesome when I did that and then I also had like other Pink Diamonds like the reward ones for the weekly challenges like um, Bob Pettit uh, who was actually the last one and then the one before him was Elgin Baylor those cards were awesome and then they also dropped more Pink Diamonds later on in the year like um, they dropped a Patrick Ewing they actually dropped him twice uh, the first time I miss out on trying to get him but then the second time i was ready and i actually was able to win him and then the last one that i remember them doing was uh when they now see at the nba awards and they gave um russell westbrook the mvp and they dropped a card of his and then like i was able to get him and uh, i was super excited about that so i had like a total of five pink diamonds last year and it fit every single position where i had westbrook uh, Dwayne Wade, Elgin Baylor, Bob Petta, and Patrick Ewing. So for me to get James Harden for my first pink diamond, that's pretty sick. So, but yeah, man, this card is super nice, and I also want to check out his post fadeaway. Dude, this card is just gonna be nasty to use. I can't wait to use this in uh in super max, like I said before. All right, let's try one more. I'll do one more dunk. Uh, I, come on, do something better than that. Yeah, that's not too bad. Come on, do something bigger. Come on. Oh, that was lame. I don't think I didn't really get a running start though. <laughs> but let's see. One. Come on. Two. Okay, two. That's too deep. Okay, never mind. Three. Ah, could have been more. Please. Oh, I almost went in. Hakeem, give it to me. Fine, I'll get in my. Okay, no. Hakeem, pass it. Pat, I'm right here. Jeez. Oh, that almost went in. I'll try once more. 
Ah, oh, I thought that would go in. Dude, first pink diamond of the year, James Harden. Uh, I'm so excited to use him. Man, it's hard seeing the uh, nearly 300,000 MT go away. <laughs> I only have like 26,000. That's a pain right there. But, uh, you know, I, I think it's worth it. Um, actually, real quick, I want to check his price. So I'll do pink diamond rockets, right? It's a little slow to load up sometimes on my end, just because my internet's a little slower. Not a little bit slower, it's super slow. Uh, so, like, as you can see right here, this one's going for 300,000. So, for me, getting it. So I paid 240 something and it gave me back like 15,000. So basically uh, around 230 I paid for him, which isn't that bad. Cause like, look at these and they're so little now, but like, just look how many there are. It's insane. Like, like they just, the glitch happened for like almost a half an hour. I wish I, I knew about it at the time, but I didn't, but like, it's just insane how many cards there were. I wish I, I wish I was part of it though because then I could have you know gotten a uh, you know maybe like a buy it now for super cheap or whatever but uh yeah that wasn't the case but hopefully his price will go up because it used to be like in the millions so if it does eventually go up then I would say that's a big W right there but we'll have to see but yeah uh, right now my Sony lineup I had to rearrange some stuff but the way I have it is I have at point guard Diamond 96 Allen Iverson, Shooting Guard 99 Pink Timing James Harden, Power Forward 93 Amethyst Carl Malone, Center 95 Diamond Hassan Whiteside, and at Small Forward 96 uh, Diamond Bradley Beal. Then on my bench, we have Pete Maravich, Jojo White, Rick Barry, George Mikan, uh, Jermaine O'Neal, then Jeremy Lin. Uh, Hakeem Olajuwon and Bob Love and then I also have some extras like Spencer Hayward uh, Kenyon Martin, Martin Artest and Fat Lever and it sucks because I really like that Fat Lever so uh, You know I may end up you know switching some stuff out, but for now I think it's not too bad I would prefer to have like a point guard uh, or some kind of guard and then like small forward the power forward and center but like I mean having love there he can do small forward too which is good but yeah um you know like i would have jojo white at like starting point guard but then it would be weird because i'd have like two shooting guards in the backup even though i know they would like automatically put one at like certain position but i figure you know um iverson's like my favorite player out of all these guys so it's not too bad and like i was saying before you know like i could have gone like maybe like a lebron type player because he's actually a buy it now um like there was a lot of buy it nows for him and so i figured maybe if i could have bought him i could put him at power forward and then maybe either get him or demarcus cousins and put cousins at power forward or maybe even get both then i can have some on the bench but like just the fact that i i can say i have a 99 overall is pretty sick so problem is that since i have like a lot less mt now uh, you know, it's gonna be kind of tough trying to earn more back plus, you know, like playing with games to them Like it's gonna cost like a lot more like for the contracts and everything Actually, I do have a couple contracts, but like it's like 500 for like amethyst or Diamonds, I forgot which one it could be 600 for diamonds 500 for amethyst I'm not really sure about that, but yeah, it's a kind of a pain right there. So uh But man, I'm just so excited. I got this card. It looks like a beast and he's only 500 salary cap by the way just want to let you guys know that so uh yeah i think that's gonna wrap this video up you guys hope you guys enjoyed this video and uh yeah thanks for watching you guys the be bold coming soon and until next time later peeps oh yeah be sure to follow me on twitter at dr j24 gave me to keep out a post and be sure to subscribe to my youtube channel to keep up more nba 2k18 call of duty star wars battlefront 2 and gta 5 as well later peeps oh wait actually no i <laughs> really quick I want to check um, LeBron super fast. It's kind of a weird outro, but I'm gonna not put him up for uh, 100,000. I'm gonna do just under that by like 50. Just want to see his price. I saw one go for like 82,000 earlier, and I didn't know if I should buy it or not. And maybe I should have because I would have saved a little bit right there. So like 90 something thousand right there, and then I'm gonna go like mid 60s. 
and I'm gonna do pelicans for Demarcus Cousins. And I don't know what's worth it, having two diamonds 95 or one pink diamond 99. It's a little tough to say. I'm not entirely sure what I would do. I don't know what you guys would do. If you have any suggestions, let me know. But like 60,000 for them, that's not even that bad. So I could have paid 160,000 total for two diamonds and I could have still had like 100,000 left. But so I did a 99, but hopefully maybe eventually like his price will go up and if I want to, I can sell them. So I don't know, but uh, if you guys have any suggestions on what I should do, just let me know and leave a comment or whatever. And uh, yeah, but yeah, that's gonna wrap this up. Hope you guys enjoyed and uh, yeah, later peeps.